Hey, Netflix bangers, we have got amazing news for you today. The world's largest streaming service has just released information on its most popular television shows and movies for the first time ever. Some underrated movies are in the list. You will be shocked to see which season ranked first. But on which basis were these movies and shows ranked, and is your favorite show or movie in the Netflix's top 10 list? Watch this video till the end to find out. Since the first episode of House of Cards aired in early 2013, Netflix has started producing original television shows and movies. There have been several notable successes over that period, including movies and TV series titles that have overtaken social media and even physical buzz, for better or for worse. Netflix had previously only sporadically revealed what its 200 million subscribers are enjoying. And even then, the unconfirmed information is focused primarily on how many account holders started watching something, rather than whether or not they finished it. Netflix has a reputation for being extremely secretive with the volumes of data it has. The Squid Game has just premiered on Netflix last week, and it's highly likely that you've already seen a clip featuring bizarre masks and mobs of people dressed in bright teal jumpsuits. Welcome to Squid Game. The survival thriller is currently the most watched television show in approximately 80 countries, making it the first original Korean series to reach the top of the ratings charts in that time. Money Heist, the famous Spanish crime drama, was the most popular non-English Netflix series of all time until this month. But in the meantime, Squid Game will definitely replace Money Heist as the company's most popular show, according to Ted Sarandos, co-CEO. Netflix's co-CEO Ted Sarando said on Monday, Squid Game, Netflix's dystopian Korean thriller, has a very good chance of being the streaming service's most popular show ever. Sarandos, who is also the chief of content at Netflix, made the remarks on Monday at the Los Angeles Code Conference. He continued, there is a show on Netflix right now that is the number one in the world, like everywhere in the world. It's called Squid Game. Squid Game will definitely be our biggest non-English language show in the world, for sure. Sarandos did not disclose the metric used to determine the popularity of Squid Game. Previously, Netflix has determined the success of its originals by calculating the number of people who watched a title for at least two minutes over its first 28 days. And now we have the top 10 most watched original TV shows and movies in Netflix's history, as they were revealed for the first time on Tuesday at the Code Conference, hosted by Vox Media. The list was compiled based on both the number of households that began watching and the number of hours spent watching in the first four weeks after a show or movie was released. Given that Netflix's much lauded early originals such as Orange is the New Black, House of Cards and Bloodline were launched at a time when the company had a third of the number of subscribers it has today, it's possible that these shows may not appear on these lists. Let's see the list to find out what the top 10 most popular shows and movies are. But before we move forward, press the like button if you're enjoying this video. Well, the numbers speak for themselves. In terms of both number of accounts and hours spent, Bridgerton Season 1 is the most watched television series. There are also two non-English language titles on the list, Lupin and Money Heist. Although it's unlikely that any of the titles that make the list will come as a surprise to you, with successful shows such as Stranger Things and Money Heist making an appearance on the list, it's worth noting that it isn't always the first season of a show that receives the most views. Well, it's not a surprise for us. The hugely popular show Squid Games is missing from the list, and that is reasonable because it was released on the 17th of September and has not completed 28 days of release yet. Now, if we talk about movies, you can see that 28's horror and sci-fi Bird Box is on top of the list, based on the view hours in the first 28 days, having 282 million hours, and Extraction is on second with 231 million hours. If we talk about the best movie based on the number of accounts that have watched at least two minutes in the first 28 days, then Extraction comes to the top with 99 million accounts beating Bird Box, who is in second place with 89 million accounts. Now, of course, Netflix has been very confidential with such data in the past, but fans are absolutely loving that Netflix has officially released these statistics, and they can see if their favorite movie or show is on the list and where it stands. What do you think about it? What is your favorite show or movie? Is it in the Netflix's top 10 list? Let us know in the comments section. 
This sums up our video. This is all the information released till now. We will keep bringing you such videos, so make sure you have subscribed to the channel and press the bell icon, and we will see you in the next video.